All right, what up, Yahoos again? Uh, I'm gonna teach you how to block traffic from uh, three uh, networks over here. We, uh, you know, the intel that we've received is that these three addresses here are uh, known terrorist networks, uh, and they're trying to access our uh, our good American systems uh you know and yeah this is all just a <laughs> mock scenario we're just it's just for teaching purposes these probably are not real terrorist networks i don't know uh maybe they are you might want to check that out but uh this is just for the sake of a tutorial and so what we're going to do is create a standard access list number 25 and what we're going to do is click on the router here uh, and this is through lab sim uh, if anybody you know I guess it doesn't really matter because if this was a real life situation that's exactly how it would look anyway this would be a router this would be the internet so anyway so what we're going to do is going to come in here we're going to hit enter we're going to enable okay conf t and what we're going to do is ACC tab. That's going to give us our access list. We're going to call that 25. We're going to de deny host. And then we're going to type in 199.68.111.199. That's going to deny that host. It's pretty straightforward and simple. Access list 25 says deny host and then the rest of it. You know, that shows you how lazy. I didn't even want to say the rest of the numbers. So I'm going to hit enter. Hit the lazy button, which is the up arrow, and it basically just puts up there what you just put in. And we're going to go back and we're deny also uh, 202.177.9.1. Okay. Hit enter. Lazy button backspace it oop, a little too far to 11.55.67.11 okay hit enter uh, and what we got to do now is lazy button backspace we're gonna go all the way back and uh, permit any and that just basically means uh, permit anything else other than these three networks. Because if you don't hit this in here, there's an implicit deny all at the end of a standard access list or even uh, an extended. So uh, this is going to allow anything else. Otherwise, nobody else would be able to get on. So hit enter. We're going to apply this to the interface uh, S. 0 slash 0 slash 0 and we know that because that's what it tells us to do over here see right there so click back in there hit enter what we're going to do is we're going to hit IP and the reason we got to I don't you, a lot of people always you know make the mistake of not putting or just trying to go here and hit access you know list and if you do that and hit tab it takes you to like access expression you don't want that you want to app apply to IP then ACC well ACCE will give you access group ACCE then tab or you can just write it out but who wants to write it? yeah so it, you're gonna apply this to the group 25 that you just created and apply it to inbound traffic and remember if it's applied to an interface, it's access group. If it's applied to a line, like a VTY line, then it would have been access list, but it's a group. So uh, it's going to 25, which is what we created up here. And from the point of the view of the router, it's blocking incoming traffic. If you're the router, you're going to block all this other, you know, all these hosts here. Uh, so it's going to be inbound traffic. You're going to hit enter, control Z. Make sure you copy, run, and start your work. Enter, enter, 
and uh, congratulations, uh, you have just saved your country. Because now, you scored 100%. All right, so uh, if that was helpful to you, then uh, subscribe and comment to the channel. If it sucked, let me know. Uh, and try to be nice about your words because, uh, dude, you know, don't hurt my feelings, man. You know what I mean? Take it easy. I'm sensitive. Later.